I don't know. <sighs> One day at a time. I hear you. Oh, man. Thankfully, Damon teleported out of here so he didn't find out about us. Phew! How did Damon get here so fast, you know? Like, how did Drew get his brother into his thing without, like, Damon even knowing his brother? Who cares? Whatever. It doesn't matter. All right, so we missed writing on the message board. Although I looked at them all, I didn't see the option to write on the message board, so I'm assuming that was the, the messages outside of the uh, rooms. So I don't know. I don't know. Go seniors. Good luck, seniors, actually, but, you know, close enough. Okay, if we get the option to graffiti... <laughs> the wet cement. Uh, it looks like we're leaving the school again. So never mind. So I think we missed two things actually. Yeah. That is some cool ass looking fire. No. It's weird that those candles are lit <laughs> when there's no one here. Yeah, there they are. Here they are! Oh, and there's Drew! He's a little bitter now! Just kidding. Get off the stage! Is someone gonna be sick and we gonna have to stand in? I'm calling that right now. We're gonna have to stand in, are we? has been so messed up. At least I can talk to Rachel now. If I can find her back here. Yeah, with all three of these people. Um, <laughs> fuck, remember that easy jump Frank I told you about? Yeah, not quite. At first, I jacked Samuel's keys to the dorm, but suddenly I passed Skip. I actually bummed him out so bad he snapped at Wells. Felt shitty about it, but I had to get inside. Took a brief detour inside Elliot's room, and I read his poetry. Dude's got feelings for me, I think. I'm flattered, I guess. Anyway, I found the catch, but then Drew and Mikey showed up, followed by Frank's psychopath boss, Damon. Have ever met someone that... You just never knew who to fuck with? I hadn't until today. Damon started beating the shit out of Drew for the money he owed. I stood with Mikey like Drew wanted. It was horrifying. I think Damon actually broke Drew's knee after I gave Drew the money instead of holding back for Frank or giving it to Damon. It felt like, uh, felt like the right thing to do. It was so, so fucked. And the most fucked up part that I, that I had that I had anything to do with it. Chloe, the regifter. Okay, that's it. Alright, so... Oops. So... Wait, ha what? We miss someone? How? Damon Merrick. Merrick Ista. I uh, spent a few days with Darren Merrick and you could tell he's a peace-loving guy who guards the spare time. Loves unicorns and rainbows. Oh, and breaking people's kneecaps, of course. It's simply, it's the simple pleasures. Honestly, I don't know a lot about this guy. I know he collects on his debts. His name is written all over the mill like he might even scare Frank. I think they work together, but unlike Frank, he's got a bite to match his bark. Everyone at the mill that night seemed to know him, but every time I asked them about it, they... Clapped right up, right the hell up, and you have to be a special breed of fucked up to scare any kind of sense of the criminal element of Acadia Bay. The one thing everyone will tell me, those guys, bad news bears. <clears throat> Alright, Steph! Um... Dim -dim 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 Chloe and Steph, my way to the hospital! Mikey, tell me what happened. Poor Drew, I'm still stunned. Thank you for what you did. Shit, I'm glad you're going. Let me know if I could, if I could help more. Thanks, I will. Yay, we're doing good things, but it's definitely gonna get shit in Frank, maybe. Well, they might understand. I don't know. Must be Steph. Sucks that she has to miss this. Oh, yeah, so she wrote notes for everyone. That's good. <laughs> Wait, did I just Boy, throw my butt? Presents... Firework. Laser light spectacular. <laughs> That's amazing. I would love to do stuff like that. Woo! That's so cool. It's great. Awesome. The light board. What's up, Hayden? Even Hayden seems super into this play. What is happening? I've, I've always wanted to be a part of drama class in high school. Hey, Hayden. Address me as Ferdinand, good lady. 
Go fuck yourself. <laughs> no. Uh, all right. Um, hey, Ferdinand. Sup, Chloe. I mean, sup, fair maiden. Great. Weird. Uh, method acting. I just want to be a part of drama really? in high school. Thanks. They messed up my schedule. Like I think it was grade nine or grade ten. I don't remember. And they forgot to put me in it. <laughs> And then I tried to actually get into it a couple times. That's some shameless eavesdropping there, Samantha. What's, what's, uh, what's his face, Nathan? And, uh, I don't know, his dad, maybe? Hey, Samantha. Shh. Does somebody have a crush? Nathan, please. That's a bliss. Do it, Dad. I'm sorry. Keep your voice down. Now listen. You don't understand. They all hate me. They're just gonna laugh at me. Oh, Why do you issues? suppose that is? Oh, his dad is weird. No, because you show weakness, just like you're doing right now. But dad, when will you learn that this isn't about you and your problems? This is about the Prescott name, my name. <laughs> what a dick! You will not embarrass me. I got this. Can probably embarrass you, dude. Nathan. Yes. Good. Yes, me too. Now. How about this? Break a leg. I'll see you after the show. Jesus Christ, dude. Great pep talk, Mr. P. Everyone knows the best way to instill confidence in someone is by intimidating them. I you don't go, know Chloe. who you are, but mind your own business. <laughs> I'd love to. Don't you have, like, a private bunker filled with gold coins where you could have these conversations? <laughs> Good shit. And she's not gonna be happy. Hey, welcome, dickhead. Fuck! He is not good at method. Whoa, did you see that? Did you see that foot? Chloe just broke her foot! I, like glitched out and swung around. Hey, there's the thing I did. Samantha seems pretty torn up about um, what happened between Nathan and his dad. Anyways, I tried to get a drive a class a few times. Every time, I've for some reason or other, it failed. Nathan's dad is. Franchise gave up. Some asshole. Maybe huh? for the best. No, I wish he'd just go away and leave him alone. I don't know who Samantha is. Should be thankful. No, no. Nathan's dad sucks. But you should be careful what you wish for when it comes to parents. Oh, Chloe, I wasn't thinking. I'm sorry. This girl looks pretty young. For what? You didn't kill my dad. Or did you? <laughs> <laughs> that was a I wonder why she was in a... Uh... I, no. Your dark sense of humor reminds me a lot of Nathan's. Actually, the two of you are really similar. Ooh. Uh, what the hell does that mean? I'm serious. You're both artistic and well, surprisingly sensitive. You've been through a lot, and a lot of people unfairly judge you for it. I think you stood up for Nathan yesterday because you know what he's going through. Nathan's hurt, and he needs help. But whenever I try to help him, it always seems to make things worse. If you were Nathan right now, what would you want me to do? <sighs> give him up, give him help, give him space. Give him space, I guess. When I'm super angry, I need to let it all out. Same. The last thing I want is someone trying to calm me down. <laughs> exactly. Case in point. Hundred percent. Pissed he was when we tried to help him yesterday. If I were you, I'd give him space and wait for him to come to you. Or at least wait for him to calm down. That actually makes sense. Thanks, Chloe. Whenever I'd get mad, and like my parents would yell at me for getting mad. I really wish they'd just let me give me some time to chill out. Bitter much? <laughs> I don't get bitter. I get even. Wonder which bachelor contestant Victoria stole that line from. Uh, R.A. sucks is Prospera. Didn't I graffiti this in the first episode? Pretty sure that was inside the dressing room. Boys changing tent. Thanks. But no thanks. <laughs> Fair enough. Right, figures we're seeing if I can get in there. 
But anyways, as I was trying to say, I, I do should, feel like I've already seen I would have a bad time. When Rachel plays with fire. Rachel plus swords should be fun. Um, I do feel like it'd be kind of weird for me to do. I don't know. No Acting feels kind of cringy. <laughs> for me, I feel like it would be a very cringy thing for me to do because I wouldn't be very good. At, or, I, or I'd be one of those people that tries to do it too hard, you know, and then it would just come off really bad. How's your super long errand going? Yo, crazy shit happened in Drew's room, like, really bad. Oh no, are you okay? Do you need to talk about it? I thought she was gonna ask, like, why? Drew's room? Why are you there? Yeah, lady, don't. Yeah, later, don't worry until the show's over. I'm backstage. Great, I'm on my way. Oh, she's not even here yet. Oh, I'm done talking to everybody yet. Drama teachers always seem so. <sighs> dramatic. Sup, Mr. Keaton. What's up, uh, dude? The birds flee the girl, as do her thoughts. Their presence replaced by madness. I'm not crazy, you're crazy. Do you still believe true love is a lie? Mm. Sorry, I turned to mosquito. I don't, I don't know. know. I guess the whole point of love is to leave yourself open to <laughs> whatever happens. That's true. <laughs> Indeed. That is an art many of us attempt and precious few master. Budding dramaturge. May your propitious appearance counteract the tragedy of Stephanie Gingrich's sudden recusal. An emergency, she says. Okay! Uh -huh. Word. Stephanie was our lion of the light board, but platitudinal though it may be, oh, the show must be doing? sojourn forth. That dude is... weird. Maybe that'll be my job. You already kind of figured out how it works, so, you know... Dana? Looks like Victoria has finally Doug pushed Dana dig over the David's edge. Garden, or did David dig Doug's? What are hey, you talking about? Dana. Did Doug dig David's garden? Tongue or did David dig Doug's? Did Doug dig How David's garden? Or did Doug dig David's garden? Dig to dig to dig. Sports just look so. Go, let's go! <laughs> Good. Drew seems to be the captain of every Blackwell sport. Captain Drew North. I hope he's okay. Well, yeah, he's not, but uh, who knows? See, another reason to be thankful for my uh, recent life change. Samantha. Um. All right. I think. Oh, is this the push? Or did David dig Doug? What's just the, okay, that's the boys' changing room. After all the work Steph did, it's amazing that she would drop everything to be there for Mikey. It's not a whole lot of things, actually, but okay. What the? The dug a dig dig dug a dig 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 a dig dug dug dig a dig dug dug dug. Does that say Steve list? All the Steves in the world! Steve Jobs! Steve Jonason! Steve Bilba, 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 Bilba. She definitely didn't hear me just ask for Rachel. What are you doing? Am I crazy or are there butt physics in this game? I swear, like, look at that. See, it, like, bounced! That's weird. Why are there butt physics? Oh, no. What are you doing, asshole? You're about to put a pill in one of those, aren't you? do whatever that was it was shady as shit swap them I need to find whatever Victoria slipped into that drink so uh, I just talked to Damon he said he said he had to come down hard didn't see you what happened did you find the money price where's the money it's a serious quit fucking around unless you're dead reply Let's meet tomorrow. Have answers. Okay, here's what we do. We say exactly what you said. He didn't have the money. I think that's, uh... Why would, why would you leave the drugs in here? That's kind of stupid. Empty. Oh. That's an empty the Only purse. Only the finest child slave <laughs> for Victoria Chase. Oh. Probably reflections in video games are very difficult to do. Adding putting on makeup to the long list of reasons I wouldn't be caught dead on stage. See me or Mr. K for makeup kits. 
<sighs> Whoa, see the way those pills flipped? Let's see what this is. Victoria this. Chase is actually a pretty talented photographer. Look how sad Nathan looks. Why does that piss me off so much? What is... Oh, that's the statue. Well, it looks like he's about to cry. <laughs> I will never live up to the man you used to be, Dad! <laughs> a picture of a picture. Cool. That was actually pretty good. Good job. GG, no reason. Victoria no! Chase is actually a muscle no. relaxers? Just, um... So my... Swap the teas. Hurry now before your tea gets. <sighs> what are you doing here? This area is for cast and crew only. Or are you only here to try and sabotage the play like you sabotaged my homework? <sighs> God. <you're so> <laughs> Look at that smile. Here for me? What does that mean? Oh, I'm not here for the play. I just enjoy hanging out in large tents <laughs> with naked people. <sighs> Whatever. Rachel enjoyed that answer. Oh, were we not gonna, like, you know, hey! Oh, Rachel Amber, it was customary among the thespians of ancient Greece for the understudy to offer hot tea to the lead actress on opening the Uh uh! As a you stop that shit right now! For her tutelage. It is in that spirit that I offer you this beverage. May it help to reveal the essence of your talents for all to see. First of all, let's only a half cup of tea. That, um... Thanks? Wait, wait, layer! Wait up, Rachel. Try Bitch, dosed I... your tea. Excuse me? How dare you? Victoria, could this possibly be true? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> Dropout Chloe is clearly directing her misplaced anger at me. There's no I'm way. I'm sorry she your life is a mess, but it's not my fault, okay? Hmm. Chloe, Victoria is my friend. Uh oh. She would never do anything to sabotage me. Uh oh. Then she should drink the tea. Yeah, get her. The then she it. should prove it. Drink the tea. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't dare insult Victoria's integrity like that. Empty your pockets. Then oh, again, no. if that's what it'll take to convince you that Victoria is a good and caring person, fine. Switch the T. Come on, Switch Vic. the T. Put drop out Chloe in her place once and for all. Uh, it's only a muscle relaxer, right? That's the worst that could happen. She gonna do it? Yeah, probably. Whoa, why you look so nervous? Why why are you like stopping? Oh, happy? So happy. Ugh, whatever. If you're done accusing me of things, I'll just be on my way. Bitches. I mean it's possible she didn't do that, <laughs> but Wow. Maybe maybe that was Save a red herring. My ass again. Price. All in a day's work. And this has been a particularly batshit crazy day. Oh, hey, uh, that's mine. A what? shirt for oh. a free spirit. I knew you were gonna pick that one. Oh, yeah, crazy you thoughts can read and me stuff. like a script, Rachel Amber. You would have said that regardless of the shirt I wore. We're ruined. The show is ruined. Sweet tarnations. <laughs> that was quick. Oh, oh tarnations? My dear young artists. A misfortune most unkind has befallen us. Juliet is waylaid. That infernal uh -oh. inferno is the culprit, closing down the roads and robbing us of our aerial. My wonder who's going to play aerial. Manifest on her master's whim as a true spirit. Alas, devoid of an understudy, the situation is a dire one indeed. I'm afraid we may have to cancel. But wait! Truly, we are a cursed lot. Even my prodigious imagination cannot conceive of a worse turn of fate. Huh. Rip. Touche. <laughs> what? Uh, uh, oh, no. Mr. Keaton. No. Chloe could step in for Juliet. No fucking chance. At least until the road's clear. No! 
Oh, so go away, I'm sure. The romantic. She's the right fit for Juliet's costume. She is indeed. Tell me, my dear, have you ever acted before? No. Hell no. She's being modest. We play improv games all the time. And she's fantastic <laughs> at it. My dear, what if I told you that the entire fate of the production rests upon your slender shoulders? Stop looking at my shoulders! <laughs> Victoria's just Sherry, dead. You're super fucked. Chloe, please. For me. This is a choice. It's gonna be a weird choice. Cause like obviously, it's not like I'm the one acting. Please don't make this a choice. Damn it. <laughs> nice cutaway. <laughs> wow, she actually looks really good in that. I can't believe Rachel's talked me into this. No way. Damn. She's the Raven. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Damn legs for days. I seriously have to memorize all of this. Uh oh. Thanks, Rachel. All hail, great mistress. I come to answer thy best play. You know, I actually have to remember this, don't I? I like stuff out. Your your cure? I already know. Your oh, your Q. Enter Ariel. Uh, Ariel, all hail, great mistress. I come to answer the best pleasure. Jesus, I boarded the kingship. I feel like I'm gonna actually have to remember some of this. Oh no. Aboard the king's ship in every cabin, I, I flamed amazement, the fires and cracks on sulfurous roaring, the most mighty Neptune seemed to be see- Okay. Yeah, we'll just wing it. <laughs> Fuck it, we'll wing it. Cool, the show's starting. You got good seats, right? Oh, you'll see. <laughs> Alright, what what house have I missed? Cool reflector of the hypocrisy times. Okay, so it looks like we're at the end of the episode. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we did miss two. That sucks. I guess we were supposed to graffiti when the cement. gives you lipstick, use it to tag shit. Um, once we got the keys from Samuel, I guess? Tragedy. Got it. Got it. <laughs> she unlocked Vanity Fair. Um. Cool. Uh, Alright. I don't know what death would have looked like. Death mask, I guess? That's a thing. Why does it feel like Steph is mocking me from afar? Let's look at it. Look at it! Chloe actually looks super good! Why does it feel like Steph is mocking me from afar? Good job, Chloe. You're pulling that Rachel off great. Rachel thinks this is a comedy, but it's a tragedy for me. I, I like how she doesn't even see the irony that she's been seeing Crow the Raven. The only thing worse than now she's looking one. at spandex is being forced to wear it. <sighs> looks like I'm late. As usual. What time it is? There she is! Aspera. Miranda. I think that's it, right? Cool. Well, I'd imagine this is pretty much the end of the episode. Well, we're gonna have a bit more to do. Oh god, this is gonna go badly, isn't it? Time for my stage. big debut. Alright! Let's see what happens. I'm sure it's gonna go great! I can't wait! <sighs> By accident most strange, bountiful fortune hath mine enemies brought to the shore. Here, cease more questions. <gasps> Thou art inclined to sleep. Tis a good dullness, and give it way. I know thou canst not choose. Come away, servant. <gasps> That's me! Come. Ah, shit. I'm on. Uh, oh, oh, that's you. I am ready now. Get up there. Approach, my Ariel. Come. Damn it. No Here problem. Here I go. I've got this. What am I doing? I, I just like waddling. walk to Rachel and Sad. say my line. 